we can get it right. Oh, that's it. Oh, Steve, we get it. Oh, Stay Foundation. Yeah, what's going on? Thanks for coming. Uh, Y'all call me on the way pick, know, I'm picking my mail up. And for those who don't know who we got right here, Stevie J, what's going on with you? What's going on? What's up, what's, what's up going on? What y'all doing out here, State Five Nation? We up? just wrapped up another interview, but we glad you're down here. We got you. I came to get my mail. What's happening? So now, what's been going on with you and, and Diddy and uh, 50 Cent? It's a lot going on. You want to fight people? Just give us a little information, please. <laughs> Listen, bruh. This dude, this little Rod, he, he filed that little complaint with a plethora of false allegations and claims in there, and he got my name all in there, so people been jumping out the window, and Fifth was one of the dudes that jumped out the window, so, you know, I, he made his remark, I made my remark back, I ain't say nothing too crazy, I just said, you know, if it's entertainment, let me beat you up on TV. I said, wait a minute, wait, wait a minute. You know what I'm saying? I now, of course, when Curtis. When you, also oh, used to, you did say his name. I did say it. I did say his name. He said my name, so I said his name. But you know, he's like he said, it's entertainment. So let me entertain the people. You know, I like to entertain the people. And so now, people said it could be clout. It could be the because you were. We don't like to get into clout your history. Not me. I don't need no clout. You were locked up before over child support. One thousand eighteen. I had that. I had that. That day she didn't come and get it. I had it sitting on the table for. Her. Bruh. You know what I'm saying? But in any event, I went to jail two thousand eighteen for that. But I had that bread for her, but she didn't come get it. But in, that's that's in the past. That's behind me. So what? About, okay. And now, what about the people that said they would love to see like? 50 beat you up because <laughs> I now, think that'll be a good from us. I think, listen. They said they want to see 50 beat you up just because you you were with faith and nobody likes you after that. I said, hold up, wait a minute, something ain't right. Let's let's take bets. Let's let's put a wager on it. You know I ain't got a problem. If y'all want to bet on fifth, bet on fifth. Whoever want to bet on me, because I'm going to put all my bread on me. I'm going to put, if it's entertainment, you know what I'm saying, let me bloody your chin up a little bit. And listen, bet on whoever you want to bet on. We can do it on pay-per-view. I'm calling you out. We can do it on anybody. Anybody want to do it. I'm ready to do it with anybody, you know. And, and I felt like this, but way, but way before prison, you know, a lot of people got a problem with me because I'm outspoken and, and, and my antics, you know, I went to the radio station. They said I tried to pull my piece out on the two female. I ain't do that. They, and people are mad because the interview I gave at Star Island, I was on Star Island, the home that they raided and all that. And I was, you know, supposedly, allegedly getting top in the bag while doing the interview. Listen, if you infringe on me, and I'm not going to stop what I'm doing because you want to interview. Like, I'm going to get my mail and you stop me. I stop to talk to you. You got to accept the good and the bad. And so, now, we don't want to... <laughs> nice young lady. Okay. Anyway, okay. Um, so, now, have you been talking to... Jo Did you talk to Jocelyn lately? I haven't spoken to Jocelyn. No, I haven't spoken to her. Okay. I wish her the best. I hope she's thriving. You know, I hope everybody's thriving. I don't like the dirt they putting on Daphne and all, you know, because she was gang and they putting dirt on her, but it ain't like that. Young Miami, they putting dirt on these ladies. Ain't not, all them allegations is false. Everything is false. Bruh. And so now, would you... Just because people say it don't make it true. Believe, remember that. Why now? Why now to come out when all this controversy... And things is going on. Why for what who, who me to come out? Why did you why do you think your name would come? I think that, I think little, that we don't like to mention the rod. I think it's a cash that. grab basically and being that the gentleman said that he, he was in awe of me, that's how I was thrown in the mix. But it's a cash grab and eventually it's gonna come out, you know. Everything that's done in the dark is gonna come to the light. You know, just because I was one of the hitmen don't mean I was hitting men. And all that, you know, they playing word semantics. But but if you want me to hit you, all you got to do is get in the ring with me. You know what I'm saying? I'll show you why I wanted to hit me. So before we get you out of here, it's no it's no surprise you did frequent the Diddy Party parties. Yeah, I was one of the hitmen. I'm one of the producers. I was, you know, I was around. That's my best friend. Yeah, I was at Star Island. You seen me at Star Island give an interview in the bed where I was allegedly getting top. You know what I'm saying? You seen her hand. But oh, come on. Did you, you see any... Any what? Underage, like... Hell no. Around. I never seen nothing. Listen, we, we we adults. We we don't have to... My, and Diddy don't have to mess with underage girls. He's a, Diddy been a mogul a long time. And I take issue with the with the feds, you know what I'm saying? 
looking for past your manifest, who he flew in and out. When you've been a mogul 30 years and you're doing business all around the world, you're going to fly a lot of people in and out. So don't let the government paint false pictures and false narratives. The public, y'all been fans, of, whoever been fans of Bad Boy and Diddy and me for years, stay fans. Don't let them just slander all your black lead, your all people that you aspire to be like. You know what I'm saying? Not saying I'm better than anybody else, but listen, don't let them just tear us all down like that. You know what I'm saying? Everybody's innocent to proven guilty and just because somebody said it, don't make it true. Thanks for I gotta stopping. get out of here. Thanks for giving us this interview. Stevie J, thank you. Shout out to the State Fly Nation.